we became aware on December 30th, 2019, that the Indiana Division of Forestry released four new draft resource management guides for the Old Putnam State Forest. For those not familiar with the process the state uses in regards to timber sales and harvest, the resource management guides are the first step in that process. The release is also the start of the 30-day comment period, which is the one and only time in the harvest process that the citizens have a chance to voice their concerns about these proposed timber sales and harvest on publicly owned state forest property. I'll now give you a brief overview of each of these resource management guides, the complete guides and instructions on how to submit your comments can be found at the link included in the email. The first guide is on track two, located in compartment two, which is made up of 80 acres with a proposed removal of 25 to 33 percent of the standing volume, which amounts to 215,000 to 285,000 board feet. The second guide is tract three in compartment eight, which consists of 66 acres with the proposed removal of 25 to 33% of standing volume, which amounts to 175,000 to 233,000 board feet. Number three is track 10, compartment eight, which consists of 52 acres with a proposed removal of 25 to 33 percent of standing volume, which amounts to 136,000 to 180,000 board feet. And the final guide is on Tract 7, Compartment 9, which consists of 78 acres with a proposed removal of 25 to 33 percent of standing volume which amounts to 203,000 to 270,000 board feet. The totals of these harvest, these harvests proposed in the Indiana Draft Resource Management Guides, if all four are sold and completed, are total acreage of forest affected, 276, of which the forest will lose 25 to 33 percent of the standing trees. Note, this figure does not take into account number of trees destroyed or damaged during harvest and the follow-up timber stand improvement. These losses are not accounted for. The total board feet of timber actually sold would range from a low estimate of 729,000 board feet to a high estimate of 868,000 board feet. All of these numbers were gathered, gathered at the aforementioned DNR website. Now on a personal note, as you read the resource management guide, as I hope you will, pay close attention to the references on how these tracks will remain fully stocked after these harvests and how our publicly owned land is listed as commercial. You may also notice how strikingly similar, if down not exactly the same, these separate tracks are said to be. One more point I'd like to make you all about uh, is all that's written and spoke of the best management practices. You see behind me an example of that here at Cerber Road in the Owen Putnam State Forest. This harvest was done in 2019. So, thanks for your thanks for your time, and please remember, the last day for you to comment on these latest draft resource management guides is January 28, 2020.